All right, so opening the box, we have a packing list, little quick start guide, some sample filament to test something. Then this looks like our toolkit. So this is actually packed very well. I'm going to tip this down. So you can see that it has a lot of really heavy foam. Um, should really protect the mini well. So I'm going to open the quick start guide just to make sure that I do things according to, uh, according to plan. It says start here. Unpack it. Okay, carefully remove the foam, take printer out, and that's it. So, pretty easy, pretty easy instructions. Okay. Has a couple of large blocks of foam which make removing it a little difficult. This is how you know this is not rehearsed. This is live. Okay. So with that, we will set the box aside. Like I said, some pretty big chunks of foam in here to make sure that nothing moves the extruder around. And then some smaller blocks of foam to make sure that the gantry doesn't move around too much. So I'm going to remove the foam from the x-axis. Then there's also some foam on the y-axis that we're going to remove. And I believe that that is all of the material holding things in place. So swing that up. All right, I'm going to set the printer to the side. And we'll take a look at what is in, what is in the toolkit. So, if anyone has had a Molesbot TAS-4, a lot of very similar things in here. So there is plastic bag, small Allen key, some replacement, uh, some replacement fabric strips, which is what is used for self-cleaning the nozzle, USB cable, power cable, a tweezers, and a small metal brush and a small dental pick. And there's also this oyster knife for removing the uh, for removing the prints from the build plate. USB stick, and this is the test print that was printed on this machine before Lulzbot sent it out. So there's the Lulzbot Mini Quick Start Guide. Then we go in here. It's a neat poster. Just talks about the walls about many different terminology, uh, different, just describing everything about how the printer works, what it is. I think this will be a very useful thing for beginners to get up and running, just so they understand more about 3D printing in general. Then there is the safety and warnings sheet. A walls about sticker, so safety and warning sheet. Let's see. Safety and warnings, uh, EC declaration of conformity, quality assurance record, and a packing list. So you know that everything was packed in here appropriately. And then there's also a little test piece of filament, which I think is ABS filament. But for unpacking the Lulzbot Mini, that is what is in the box. We will have a review up shortly. Once we have everything connected, we've had a chance to test everything. Been here a year. Woo! <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> um, yeah, so it was only uh, just a little bit over. <laughs> even the head crab is excited. Uh, just a little bit over a year ago, 